Hello everyone, my name is Kate and welcome to my channel. Well, I decided to change my clothes from the um, car vlog video. So, now I'm doing a switching of the bags. This is, was another difficult one. As you can see, I'm wearing mostly pink. Well, this is kind of a salmon. This is kind of a coral. It's kind of like not my, it's not my hot pink shirt or my hot pink scarf. So, you all know I've been carrying my sunflower satchel, which I absolutely love. My daughter loves it. I mean, everybody does. But I, you know, I can't keep carrying it. It was raining so bad today. I have sandbags at my um, back door where my porch is. With like this deep, if I didn't have the sandbags, it would run down my back steps and would flood my basement. That's how bad it's raining today. So, anyway, here she is, what I've been carrying. I said she's, I don't know, absolutely gorgeous. I just love her. You know what? And I have like scratched her by accident. It doesn't even show any scratches. You can't see none. This is just all around excellent bag. But when we went on shopping day, me and my daughter, um, I took a little rain jacket, a small rain jacket. But do you know who wore the rain jacket? She did. Not me. I took it off of me and I wrapped it around my purse. People would probably people were probably looking at me like, here's a crazy woman, I'm running through the rain. But my purse was protected. I usually carry a, like I said, a trash bag in the car, but I just use my raincoat. Um, before I change into her, into something else, I want to let you know I changed the bags here. I was originally thinking of, because this is nylon, the, um, what is this called? The nylon um, large pocket, I think. Like a satchel or something. Something like that, I can't remember. But I was thinking of changing into that one. I was really that close to changing into that one. And I did put I put the Greta Gretchen bag up here that I um, was thinking about changing into because of the weather. But then I thought, I'm not going to let that weather deter me. I have things that are protect my purses. So my next thought was to change into the pink one that's just like this. My pink small satchel, or the red small satchel, which I usually leave the red for around like the fall, but you know. And then I sat there and thought and thought and thought, and before I tell you, I just want to tell you, I'll be doing an update on my planner, actually, tomorrow probably. I still have to finish up today's, and I want to try to get some stuff in for tomorrow so I can give you a very good update, so... I'm probably not going to do one a day. I usually do one every Saturday, but I'll, I'll, I think I'm going to start doing it every Sunday. Okay, so without further ado, what I'm going to change into, you all may be surprised. It is a Judy and Burt, and you wouldn't think I'd be changing into this on maybe a rainy season, and you got to be careful with the bag. My Toledo. My male medium satchel Toledo leather. I haven't carried this, I think, since fall, and I really miss this bag. And oh my god, it smells heavenly. I mean, I could smell it as soon as I took it out of the dust bag. Actually, while I was still in the dust bag, I could smell it. As soon as I opened up the dust bag. Heavenly. So, and she's always got a beautiful smile on her face. Look at this. So anyway, I'm not going to try and let this video go really long. So I'm going to switch out of her into her Toledo leather medium male satchel I didn't even tie up the um, oh this is a little wonky right here but I didn't even tie these up when I put it away this time these look okay but she looks in really good condition I don't think I see any scratches on her I had a couple scratches that I just used my dust bag and just went over it with the dust bag like this and the scratches at least minimal scratches seem to have come out so I don't really see anything and I have scratched her a lot in the past so there she is 
beautiful zipper. She's got that like dome look, but I usually carry I, I usually don't carry mine with the um, strap. I usually carry the handle because I just think it's so elegant with the handle. The handle has that whip stitching. Whoops, I'm going to drop the dust bag. I'll put it over here. So, I was going to move it all that away, but I can't yet. So, it's just beautiful. See? Nice zipper. Let me turn around here. Here is the strap. Which is, you know, it's a pretty thick strap. It's not real thin. I like this strap. You know, I might, I might carry her, like, you know, on my shoulder this time. Who knows? When, I'm, when I do this shopping... Because I, I think I've had a carrier before like that. Alright, let's take out the bubble wrap. Remember, we don't want to put paper in there. Like um, Marie Bagobean said, it's best to... Except for I have a receipt in the bottom of mine. What was that a receipt for? I don't even know. Did I get a discount on something? I don't know why that was in there. But paper can break down. And could even get caught in your zipper or you get little pieces of paper in your cotton lining. So you really don't want to put paper. If you have paper, stick it inside of the plastic bag and roll it on up and then put it in. So the paper is not actually touching the cotton lining. Just a little FYI, which I got from Marie Bag of Beans, which I always do. I always just use plastic. Look how big she is. Wow. This is one big mouth girl, isn't it? And just like all standards, you have your two slip pockets, one with a snap, and you have the zipper, the one big slip pocket right there. And we have, yep, standard key leash. So, I got a feeling, whatever I put in here, I'm still going to have room. This is one big bag. But it's, I love this opening. You can get in there, you get out. She's just great. All right, so... I'm not going to try to run this time over, so let me go ahead and start switching out. And just to make everything so it doesn't, you know, last forever, I'm just going to switch out exactly what I have in here. I'm not switching out. The, I'll probably change in my wallet, but right now I'm still using this one. The Michael Kors wallet, which is really nice. I'm going to put that in there. I am going to put my Vera Bradley makeup bag, which I have three more Vera Bradley makeup bags on their way. Because I like these, they're lightweight, they don't, um, you don't have to worry about they get really bad or something, you could actually wash these, I think, so. And my trusty old Ipsy bag from day one that carries my Kleenexes and my uh, wet wipes in it. And I have like hand lotion, I'm not sure which one I'm going to put that one in. I'll leave this out right now. And everybody knows my little notepad, which I do have notes on it. <laughs> right here, it's magnetic. My daughter got that for me. I absolutely love it. Okay, put that in the big pocket with the snap. Oh, here's my diabetic medicine. Let's leave that out. Xanax. Let's leave that out. Oh yeah, my my portable magnifying glass. I have this one. This is baby. It's really good, but this is my one I carry in my um, purse. So let me put that in the big slip pocket in the back by the zipper. And here's my little chain purse. Well, that goes great with that. Slap that down in there. And here's my. I still have never changed this out. Remember I tell you each time I'm going to change it? I don't. So, I'm going to take this and move it on over here. It doesn't, matchy matchy doesn't seem to bother me too much anymore. It's functional, it works, it's good enough for me. So, I'm going to slide everything. I got everything to this side, so I'm going to slide everything to the other side just to put those in there. I'll give you a glimpse of what's going on so far. Plenty of room. Look at that. I got room over in that corner. You see that corner over there? Right over here. I have plenty of room in that corner. Now I'm still doing good. Yeah. This must go. It's a must. With my antacids, aspirin, tonal, sewing kit, stain cleaner, 
from all the clothes and whatever else, the little emergency kit. I will put that on the side here with the keys. And I think all those pockets are cleared out except for the zipper. Do the zipper, my Ralph Lauren card case. I only have the one, I think. I never did get another one. I'll put it in the zipper here. Oh my God, this purse smells heavenly. Did I just zip up the zipper? I do that every time. Never did. I already had it unzipped it for myself and I zip it back up. And purse hangers. Remember, one for you and one for a friend. Always think of your friend. They keep falling out of this little bag. So I'm going to put them back in there again. I'm going to get a little bag of snaps like Lori has. Hers just snaps in there. It's a little tie bag. Put that in the zipper part. And that's just all tags uh, left in here like a... Oops. Her earbuds. Put that right here. God, I got plenty of room. Some stuff's falling down. There's so much room. The earbuds are right here. Okay, here she is empty. Beautiful bag. Put her right there. I'm going to restuff her. Now I do have some medications, which is my new diabetic. Medication I'm going to put on the side. We have plenty of room in here. Xanax. Which I don't really take unless I really need it. It's the, that's one thing good about Xanax. It's not like a prescription. You have to take it all the time. You can, like the doctors told me, only take it if I really need it. And then my, mm. oh, heavenly, I bought some more of this. My hand lotion, just love it. I will put that, I'm going to put it back here with my, uh, with my phone right here. Go into the slip pocket. And there you go, ladies. That's everything. In this bag. Isn't she one beautiful bag? I can't help but be biased. I knew a lot of ladies have these bags and they don't carry them that much because I guess they're worrying about the Toledo leather. But she's too beautiful to leave in a dust bag or to leave on a shelf. You know, here's a strap. If you wanted to put carrot in these straps, look how substantial this is. Look how thick. It's that brush gold, but look how thick that is. So what's my time? Getting ready to go. I'm getting ready to leave, getting ready to go. Hurry it on up. I find if I carry this, she does not really get too wonky, a little bit like that. But the dome's gonna do that. So I even have more holes here I can put it up on. Nine out of ten times, I carry it by the handle. Unless I'm actually grocery shopping, then I'll take the strap. Get your hands free. Okay, ladies, we are at 13. All right, I think that is it. I'm looking around. Like I said, I will do an update on my planner tomorrow. I have more stickers that came in the mail. I put in my new little travel carrying case that fits really good into this uh, clutch. They call it a clutch, the neoprene clutch. Just love those multicolors in the back. So anyway, I'll do an update on that tomorrow. This is what I'm currently carrying. So I hope you all enjoyed it, and I hope you all enjoyed my um, first car vlog. I'm going to try. I couldn't stand the shaking on the thing. I had to keep holding it so it's not really hands-free. So... Love you guys, and I'll talk to you later. Um, have a good rest of the weekend. Um, actually, I will be back in tomorrow. So, love you all. Bye. Stay safe. And for people on the East Coast, stay dry. Not the West Coast, of course, the East Coast.